Fight Hub TV, joined by Sugar Hill. Sugar, how are you doing? I'm okay, and you? I'm doing well, out here in Saudi Arabia. We're getting the undisputed fight, the grand rival just took place. Talk me through how has camp been, how's preparation been for Usyk? Camp has been excellent, preparation has been excellent. Uh, just happy to be here and waiting for Saturday night. Of course, the fight got postponed because of a cut. How is that cut and how have you, you know, sort of healed, helped heal that cut? Uh, the cut was stitched up and uh, everything's okay. Yeah? Yeah. How, many, how much time did Fury have to have off for that cut? And was there any detriment to that preparing? Well, when you have a cut, you don't really need time off. You can do everything except for spar. Okay. Now, talk me through Usyk. What do you see as him? What, what do you think are the sort of holes in his game that you can take advantage of? I'm just trying to make him make a mistake. When he makes a mistake, make him pay for it. A lot of people are making, you know, note of Usyk being hurt to the body a couple of times in his previous fights. Do you think that is sort of the root for Tyson to kind of exploit that weakness, quote unquote? Uh, my main issue is just boxing, being able to take the opportunities as they present themselves. If that body shot presents itself, then you have to take it. If there's a head shot, left hook, right hand, you have to take whatever's open. So if that's open, definitely go for it. Yeah, before this week, it's always been kind of cordial. There's a, you know, a bit of back and forth, but yesterday, you know, some Physical altercation did take place I think between I know the two. What you're talking about? And, uh, I wasn't there. I was in a room with Tyson doing an interview, so I don't know anything about it. And uh, for me, I don't even care about it because uh, I have a job to do. Uh, <laughs> Does that affect the psyche in any way? You know, make it personal for Tyson to you know get get that get back in the fight. I don't know. Tyson was doing an interview. I don't. I don't see any change in him from uh, the events happening. Happened yesterday. Yeah. Okay, and I want to just, how do you see that fight playing out on Saturday night? How do you see Tyson getting the win? Will it be a knockout or are you chasing, like you said, just boxing just five rounds? I should let you answer that about me. What do you think I'm going to say? I think you're going to say knockout. I'm going to say knockout. And just Every uh, time. I just want to get your thoughts on just another fighter, Canelo Alvarez, who recently fought Jaime Munguia. What did you make of that performance of Canelo? I didn't see it. I was in training camp. You didn't see the fight? I did not. Okay. Just on a hypothetical, if Canelo was to fight David Benavides from previous fights, you See, how would that fight play out? I think it would be an interesting fight uh, and a competitive fight. But as far as I can say, I would have to sit down and actually look at both fighters and their uh, most recent fights to be able to make that uh, a proper assessment of what you're asking. Yeah. I didn't see Canelo's last fight. Did you see Ryan versus Devin Haney? No. Okay, just final question from me just about uh, Terence Crawford potentially moving up to fight Canelo at 168. What do you make of that? And do you think Crawford can pull off that move to 168 and beat Canelo Alvarez? You know what? It's, it's all potential, like you said. Potentially, potentially. So I don't really think about those things because it, it's not happening. Uh, when it's officially happening, then I can take my mind and adjust and start thinking about those things. But that's how I stay looking young and sexy. No stress. I don't think about things that I don't have control over. So me thinking about that fight, uh, be a waste of time for me. Yeah. Well, I mean, hopefully if the fight does get made and hopefully we can catch up after that and talk about it then. But until then, thank you so much for your time. All right. Thank, thank you. you. Thank you so much for watching this video. And make sure to subscribe for more videos of your favorite fighters over here on Fight Up TV. And give us a follow online as well at Fight Up TV on Twitter and on Instagram. We appreciate it, guys.